guys, it's Keely. Welcome to today's vlog. I don't know really what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go grocery shopping. I'm going to clean a little bit around the house and maybe just like go to like a nursery or something. I'm in the mood to like go plant shopping. We need plants. Our house is like not, not ready to live in, honestly. I know I haven't done YouTube in a really long time and I've only done it like one time, but um, little life update. I, if you don't know me, I'm from Seattle, Washington. Actually, I'm from like Renton, Washington, which is like 20 minutes away from Seattle. I recently moved to LA last summer and I was there for like 10 months or something like that. Long story short, this past year has been really crazy. Um, my ex and I got back together in December. We started dating again. He lived in Nashville while I was in LA. Um, and we had been together for about two years before that, like a year and a half. We were broken up for a year and a half. So we started talking again. We knew that we loved each other. We knew that we wanted to be together for the rest of our lives. So we, you know, decided to get engaged and woo! Oh, it's crooked. I wasn't really enjoying my life in LA, um, so I decided to pack up my things and move to Nashville. So that's where I am right now. Um, and we just got this house together in East Nashville. Um, it's super cute, we're renting, and we're getting married in 10 days, uh, not eight, nine, eight or nine days from today. Next Friday, you'll watch this, probably not on this day. Anyway, um, so yeah, we're super happy. Um, life is crazy. And um, here we are. So that's what we're doing. What is on me? I have these like dry patches of skin. I don't know if you can see that, but it like really bothers me. I have them on this, this on too. I honestly really miss vlogging. I think it's so fun. Um, I like to show like little hairstyles that I do. I actually learned this from Amber Filler Up on Instagram. I just watched one of her IGTVs this morning and just did this, so. But I like fashion, I like beauty, um, hair, makeup, and actually not really makeup. I'm not very good at makeup. I just do a little tiny bit of dewy makeup and I'm set. I'll be doing like house updates and stuff, so. Yeah, stay tuned. Okay, so pretty much ready. Um, I just have this little $5 mirror from Target that, you know, I am using until we actually get a real mirror. So this is what I'm wearing. Um, I am recording on my phone because I don't have a vlog camera yet. So I'm winging it. Um, so I'm wearing this dress. I think I got this on Misguided. Um, I'm just wearing like a little bandeau underneath. And these shoes I got at DSW. They're like little platform um, shoes. And I just did my hair with some hoops. So just a really simple, like flowy fit today. It's really hot today. It's going to be like 90. So, and it's humid here in Nashville. So it's like extra, extra sweaty. I'm expecting like a couple packages today. So I kind of want to keep an eye out. But I don't think they're gonna come till later. I'm gonna get my sunglasses. I think I also got these on ASOS. They're just like cute little cat eye sunglasses. Um, oh, got little pigtails. Have my Topo Chico. Cheers. Oh, cheers. Okay. Are you ready, Keely? I don't know. The mask thing here is like not um, mandatory anymore. So, I mean, if you walk into a business and they're like, can you please wear your mask? Obviously you're gonna be like, yeah, of course. Um, so I have my take one, just in case. I'm gonna take a mint. I have these cute little mints in this thing I thrifted, this little bowl. Super cute. Okay. 
usually takes me forever to walk out of the house because I always forget something and I hate when that happens. Alrighty. All my tears, water, Kobo, mint, wallet, phone. For a second I was literally like, where is my phone? Make sure all the lights are turned off. We don't want that bill like going up, skyrocketing. Oh, Lord. that's windy. I just got in the car and it is wow, really, really hot. Pretty sure my phone is gonna like overheat up here, but. <laughs> this weird thing with like um I have this weird thing with driving with sunglasses on I can't do it I don't know why I've never been able to do it but everywhere else it's like a must-have or broken or something so so I decided to get this one and it's terrible like it really shouldn't be doing that maybe it depends on what kind of phone you have I don't know I don't like it okay <clears throat> I'm about to hit up Krogs oh no that's Publix should I go to Publix oh they're so good I think I I'm just gonna buy a few things. Here we go. Okay, I'll see you guys in the grocery store. So I'm in the grocery store wearing a mask because everyone else is. Um, but I have to look at my list on my notes app so I can't record. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just got like some chicken sausage, shred shredded cheese and hummus so far. But I'll see you back in the car. Alrighty, I'm sweating my butt off. <laughs> so that was the little grocery store trip that I couldn't take you on because I needed the grocery list in my notes. I am getting so hot, I wanna take my clothes off. I just spit everywhere. Next, we have to go to the mall because I'm getting, I'm getting, um, like, I need to get a, a white mini dress for this week because it's like, our we're having like a, I'm having a bachelorette party, Isaac's having a bachelor party, but it's going to be together. <laughs> so we're all going out together um, on Broadway. These are the things that I wish I thought about way in advance, I just didn't. So here I am, very last minute, eight days away from the wedding, I'm trying to buy a cute, sexy, white mini dress. And you know, I really hope that I have good luck. Also, I know this is like super west coast of me, but I recently discovered Smoothie King. It was right there and I really want one, but I'm gonna go make lunch at home. I didn't really know much about Nashville. I just thought it was like country music, um, which was cool. I've just never really been like a country music person. But the thing is, my dad is from Missouri. So growing up, we would always go visit Missouri, Kansas, Arkansas, Oklahoma. Um, so I'd be like this city girl coming to the Ozarks with flip-flops and like crop tops and they would look at me like what in the world um so it was really funny but being here kind of feels like a piece of home so I don't know I I think God really like orchestrated this so perfectly 
recently. You know, I feel like that happens a lot. Like, things happen really fast. Like, this past year has been so fast. So many big decisions, big moves, literally. And, and life just goes by like that. I'm just feeling so grateful lately. And <clears throat> I can't believe that, like, four or five years ago, when Isaac and I were dating, I just never thought our relationship would look like this. Like, I didn't think we would break up for such a long time. And then when we broke up, I never thought we would get back together, although I really wanted to. And then all of a sudden we're getting married and it's like so exciting and, and it's just different. And I think the, the choices I've made in life have been super different from the average person. Like, you know, you kind of like, you go to school, you graduate, you go to college, and then you, you stay in a sorority for four years. And I think like, it's, it's been a little bit hard for me because all of my friends from high school went off to college. They did the whole sorority frat thing which is super fun to like see from afar. It's just not my thing. And so it's just been a lot different. I've, I almost feel like I'm like five years ahead of a lot of people. And it's, I mean, it's everyone's life is totally different. So it's, I'm not complaining. I'm like so grateful for the way my life has turned out. Um, but it's not easy. Like taking things one step at a time is really important and I don't think that I've done that the past year. I've just been like, and I mean like obviously the pandemic has happened and everything, but I've just been like super impulsive this year. And I'm super excited to like settle down, be in Nashville for hopefully five years or more. I love it here. Have a consistent job for a long time. Have a lot of like consistency in my life. I'm really looking forward to that. I just, you know, like, it's been so fast. At this age, and at this time in your life, you're kind of like, wow, like, I need to slow down a little bit because I just forgot what happened in the past year because I made so many decisions so quickly and it flew by. And you don't, like, take the time to think, like, oh man, I'm so grateful. That's the deep talk for today. So I'm going to take the groceries inside and um, then I'm coming back. So I'll see you in a second. Just got this package from Amazon or from Sephora. Oh, it's a, oh, it's um, a gift from our registry. Oh, it's our little candles. So. This is the Miami one. Cold water with lemon sipped on a hot day. Palm trees bend in the sea breeze. Notes of coconut and lavender paired with patchouli. It's so cute. Oh my god, they're huge. Wow. Oh. Oh. Wow. They do really good. It actually smells like... It brings me back. Totally. Seattle, I'm not ready. Okay, let's see what it says. A strong cup of coffee on a perfectly rainy afternoon. Pine needles, lemon, and cedar meld with a hint of rhubarb and musk. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is good. They do really good. So these little... um. So these little cushions are from Walmart. They're little Japanese cushions. And um, I don't know if I showed you guys this before, but like we don't have a TV stand, we don't have a coffee table. We're getting white, um, a white cover for this couch. We got this couch for free from um, Isaac's brother. And um, these are all like um, centerpieces for the wedding. 
This is just extra. I put them in there for now. That's a cute pot that um, my favorite teacher got us from the registry. So that was really sweet. Dining room, super, super cute. I can't wait to do like a full tour and like show you guys, but I did do some crafts yesterday. I like pulled out a few pieces of um, magazine paper from the L magazine and just like did that. I don't know. Okay, I'm also so hungry. At this like Kite Hill, um, what is it called? Dairy free yogurt, vanilla almond milk yogurt. It is so freaking good, you guys. Like, oh my god, it's so good. Um, it tastes like vanilla bean ice cream. That's what it tastes like. So got some body wash, some shredded cheese, and gluten free spaghetti. Small little grocery run. So I just made this sandwich because I was really hungry. And while I was at the store, I was gonna get gluten free crackers or, like, honestly, like barbecue chips or something. That sounds so good. Um, but totally forgot. It's cool. Don't need them anyway. So please hang out with me while. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Isaac and I thrifted these um, margarita glasses for, oh, excuse me, the wedding. Um, we're having tacos and margaritas. The wedding's going to be like super small, family, casual. Um, but we thought these were pretty cool. They're really heavy. Um, and then everyone else is probably just going to have like, honestly, like plastic ones. <laughs> so we thought this would be cute for our little personal table. We bought these at Southern Thrift for, I think they were like $2 each. So... They're super cute, and it was a good steal. Um, <clears throat> that's something else I want to do on um, these vlogs is, like, go thrifting with you guys and, like, show you what we like to get. Um, recently, we've been thrifting a little bit, just stuff that, honestly, we could upsell and have a little vintage shop of our own so we've been working on that thinking about that all right so i'm gonna go pee and then head to the mall okay just got to the mall it's a 20 minute drive and i literally like you know when you space out when you're driving and you get super tired? I was like that the whole time, so I'm a little bit tired. I don't know if people are wearing, it looks like people aren't wearing masks here, so I'm just gonna wait till I get inside and if someone's like put on a mask, I will. All right. Let's hit it. Okay guys, so I literally totally forgot to vlog my entire mall trip. I'm so focused on like finding a dress for the bachelorette party. Um, I've been here for probably a couple hours now. I went to this new shop that I've never heard of before. It was super cute. Um, like a little women's boutique. They had this super cute dress, but I don't know. I just don't think it was the bond. I wouldn't wear that dress any other day. It was very, very cute. Um, but it's not the bachelorette bun. So now, um, and then I went to like Zara. I spent a long time in Zara to. Did I just take out my. I think I just took out my. Um, my time. But I'll tell you now it's time to go. So I. I'm at Forever 21 now, and I found this, like, 
Like I tried on. Yeah, I'll show you. Super cash, really nice to wear during the summer. It might actually be a little bit too hot, but that's okay. Yeah. This, this little tank um, with the ruffles at the end, and this seamless bra tank thing. Just like a few things. These are like super cheap. Honestly, I love um, Forever 21 because it's always really cheap. So I think the, the green tank is like $5. Um, seamless is like 8 and then the black is 10 I think. So, yeah. All right, so I'm back in the car. I tried to find something and I couldn't. Um, so I'm just gonna wing it or order something online even though I only have like five days left, but we'll see what happens. Either way, it'll be fine. But I am on my way home now. So I'm gonna go eat dinner and maybe watch a movie or something. So back at the house with my man. We both just got groceries today and we're getting them all in the fridge and the pantry. <coughs> and we're gonna make dinner. Um, what are we having? He got these delicious um, fudge stripe cookies. If you know, you know. Um, and they're so good. But yeah, we're pretty much just like un getting everything out of the, how do you say, unloading all the groceries. And Sweets and 
solvers. I've been trying to do that. I don't know how. Like, I put the sweets under there. Oh, yeah? Oh, me? You want us to go over there for breakfast? Oh, okay. It'll be basically the last... Should we watch church together? Yeah, we can. I'm almost going to be like cleaning up the house and getting everything ready because Maria is coming on Wednesday. You can not my brain. How will we redo them and then sleep with them again? So if no one already knew this, what what did I just say? If you don't already know this, <clears throat> I learned this at a cafe I worked at, but for small little plants, you put ice cubes in them to water them. What? <laughs> yeah. And then they just melt and it waters the plant. Uh, once a week? Um, you probably should. I've been doing it like every couple days. You kind of just like have to feel if the plant is um, like uh, damp or dry. What? Take it. What? No. Why? What did I do? It's his first time vlogging. <clears throat> Oh. You never heard that saying? Mm -mm. You, know, you gotta let things be, you can't just like stare at it. still waiting for our strainer from the registry and we started making the pasta and now I just realized that we don't have a strainer. So now what? Now we just gotta very carefully take the water very, out. Very very carefully. Take the water out without the pasta out. Okay, so we're just cooking up some sausage, chicken sausage, some pasta. We're gonna put this ragu chunky sauce, tomato, garlic, and onion, uh, butter, and then we have like a little side of broccoli, frozen broccoli. So, yeah. So I went into this store at, it's called Molly Green. That was the one that I was like, I don't remember the name, I've never heard of it before. And her name is Shelby. Thank you, Shelby, if you're watching this. Um, 
so I told, I was shopping for a bachelorette dress and I told her that um, like my best friend is coming into town and we're like going out and stuff. And so she wrote me like a ton, I told her I was like new to town and she wrote me a ton of um, places to go. And she was like, are you gonna go to Cliff and Broadway? And I was like, yeah, my fiance like really wants to go there. So she wrote down, she wrote down this cute note it says, Happy Bachelorette. It says, Hampton Social, Blanco, Casina, and Cantina, Pinewood Social, Bowling, White Limousine, Dolly Parton. Is Dolly Parton have a picture? I think it's like a bar, workshop bar, but it's not, it's not on Broadway though. Um, the Valentine, Tavern, Adele, Mangianos. So we'll have to like hit those. Hit them up. What's the way Huh? What's the way up? Holly Green. chicken sausage, tomato sauce, and broccoli. <laughs> and then we have these like little um, San Pellegrino drinks. This is called Momenti. Momenti? What you got there? Uh, this is a uh, passion fruit juice. Welch's. <laughs> okay, we're gonna eat. I miss like buying fresh broccoli and then cutting it up. Oh, that is the best. I hate frozen broccoli. Or we don't have a steamer. You can do it on the pan, baby. I know, but I want one of those things that has the colander inside. 
Do you buy those together? Like, does it come with a pot, or you just buy it separate and then use it in a pot? I don't know. The Zara at that mall though, if I had some money, I, it would be gone. Truly, it would be gone. Because that Zara was nice. It was huge. Two stories. That's where I got my um, laptop fixed at the Apple store there. Did you see the Zara? I literally went straight to the Apple store. That mall is huge. It kind of reminds me of Bellevue Mall, Bellevue Square. That's the only time I've ever been there. Very nice. We were right by there when <clears throat> remember when, when we drove in the snow? After we got my car, we came in Nashville. It was late and we pulled into the parking lot and I showed you. I was like, this is the Bluebird Cafe. Oh yeah. It's right there? No, oh. It's like right on the street. Wow. So the Bluebird Cafe is in Green Hills. Maybe. I don't know if it's exactly like, in Green Hills, but it's like race. very close. Um, how about this? Make it here. I'm gonna do the dishes. Me too. Because we both cook. <clears throat> yeah, I know. <clears throat> we'll leave those. Well, how about this? You take care of the pasta. Mm -hmm. I don't, honestly don't know what to do with it. Throw it in the container. Put it in the fridge. Oh, yeah. We have all those controls. Yeah, right. It's a container. I don't think it has a bowl. Yeah, it has Is a it? Pot. Yeah. Oh, okay. So take care of the pasta, leave the pot there. I'll do the pots later. Okay. Do you want to do these? Yeah. And I'll do the pots, but just empty it out. Mm -hmm. I'll play drums for 30 minutes. Okay. I'll play drum for 30 minutes and then we'll watch how to dance. Okay. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> Did you see those videos? Mm -hmm. Oh, babe, I gotta show you that right now. That was one of Well, folks, we just finished dinner and we're going to clean up and then Isaac's gonna play the drums for a while and then we're gonna watch Outer Banks because Isaac hasn't seen it. Um, it's funny because I talked about Outer Banks in my last vlog that I deleted. Um, but yeah, Isaac's never seen it, so I'm watching, I'm re watching it with him. Episode 3, I think. Episode 3. Is that right? Mm -hmm. It's so good if you guys haven't seen it. It's like probably a year and a half old now, but it's super good. So we're going to watch that. But we'll see you guys on the flip side. Thanks for watching. Everybody's good. Bye.